hello everyone so i am back with my new tutorial again in this i have created a pumpkin man's head part so this will be our first part in which i have shown how to make its head part and color it too so watch it till the end and thank you so first move on to our blender file now go to general now delete this default cube light and camera then go to add mesh then select uv sphere and scale it up like that now press tab for moving on edit mode now select these vertices go to select and select circle select and you can select these vertices as per your convenience horizontally vertic uh, vertically and diagonally select these so once we have selected uh, press enter and key now press s for scaling it scale it as per your conven convenience as per your choice you can now right click and smooth shade it now press ctrl 1 for adding subdivisions now keep it upwards to the grid like that now uh, first of all delete its upper and bottom face like this select it circle select it and delete it delete it arrange let's arrange the vertices up there select press one for vertex selection and select this hole now uh, uh, right click go to loop tools then select on circle now drag this little downwards like this now from bottom also do, do the same or else you can also go and scale it like this then again right click loop tools and circle selection now drag it upward like this so we have made its base part for the face of our pumpkin man so let's start making its eye uh, first of all mirror we have to mirror it for duplicating the other side first delete this face and go here select mirror now click on clipping so as you can see uh, for the eye part press 1 for vertex selection and select these corners uh, of our eye part now again loop tool and circle so then extrude it little by selecting its faces by pressing 3 and extrude it under it like this now add some loop tools or edges as you need for making it more sharp like this so let's make its nose part now so for that go here then select this vertex and this bring it little downward now I am giving it a triangular shape you can also try your own shape as you want now select this face and just insert it like this so it is looking like its nose part now let's move on to its uh, mouth part or lips part now select this vertices and press ctrl M then click on at center then Keep it here and give some shapes of its mouth as per you like you can now take a view from all the angles for uh, giving it a, a good proportion as you need like this now give it some shapes define its shapes 
now press 3 for face selection and then extrude it inside its lips part and just arrange its uh, shape as per you need you can keep it little here and make it as per your choice Now add some loop tool, loop cuts here and you can see, so now go here and apply its mirror, for applying go here then go to select apply, so let's shape it properly, its face properly. Go to our sculpting mode and here you can shape it properly by on its uh, symmetry on x-axis then try to sh give it a ni nice shape as you need for making it look uh, more cute or scary you need you want you can add like this slowly slowly you can define its shape as per your convenience choice you can add like this the mouth part now select this tool and you can make some slightly changes in it like this make some take your crease tool and then define its shape its nose eye part and the lips part uh, mouth part just uh, take a view from all the angles and add some details like this select this pinch tool and you can give it a nice detailing on your character or model which you are making Now select this grab tool and I am giving its eyes also a cartoony or triangle shape like this as you are seeing. Otherwise you can also leave it circle or any other shape you want you can add. I am not making it scary. I am just make, trying to making it a cute model. So here it is, add some loop cuts tool here also, add some edges here for making it sharp and here you can see we have made till here uh, its face part. Now let's make its upper head part, first name this pier as pumpkin head or whatever you want you can name it like this now go to add mesh then select a cylinder now keep this cylinder vertices on 12 and keep it upward here press S for scaling and let's shape that up so as you can see press E for extruding and R for rotating it rotating it then try to give it some shape as you need I am giving it a curve shape you can give it by your own choice rotate it little like this 
is now delete that bottom face and arrange it properly and you can model it like this add here a loop cut tool and make its roots or what to say that uh, even I also don't know what to say but Try to take view from its all angles and you can decide its shape properly. From here also like this and after making this a uh, base shape we will go to our sculpting mode and we can sculpt it up. Like this now add some subdivisions press ctrl 1 or add subdivision here and let's go to our sculpting mode first mode shade it like that now go to our sculpting mode and here you can sculpt it up design it size shape whatever however you like you can add make some slightly changes in it so it will look uh, cute or detailed character you can add some detailing to in that so you can see we have made its upper head part portion now uh, make uh, it look more cute or perfect like that so as you can see we have completed its head part now let's start coloring it so I will like to color it in vertex paint so select this first now go to our vertex paint uh, first of all uh, go here and apply it subdivision so you can see and upper for upper head also press one keep one level viewport and just apply that and name it also um, top head I have named it as top head like that and then let's start coloring it on our vertex paint over here then go here and select your color which you want make take a color palette and add like this so paint it in your way as you like like this make as much color palette as you need add some detailings in your coloring part which will uh, result as a nice model as one of your nice model like this now you can also blur it for giving it a nice look nice color like this like this
now give its eyes color as black eyes nose and for mouth part i will give it a black color nice black color it will look cute like this like this just color it properly like this now just give its coloring more detailed so our character will look nice like this just you can experiment some color in it for making it look more cute or what to say eye catchy you can add whatever you want in it your creativity like this so once we have finished with our head coloring like this now Let's bring that texture here on shading mode, but like this. So go here and go to new, select new. Now click on this dot, yellow dot. Then go here the over left and go select vertex color. So you can see your colored uh, part. Now don't forget to save it. So I am saving it and naming it as Pumpkin Man One, like this. Now you can see we have nicely colored it. And let's bring it here also. So select it and you can also see uh, see here the shadings like this. Now go to your this now select vertex so you can see our painted image is here now let's um, paint this top head really quick now go to your vertex paint and here also give it a brown color dark brown color uh, if you need you can also add some leaves to it for uh, like you have seen a pumpkin plant where the leaves are also there so you can add making it more attractive like this color it as per your choice as you need you can color it properly see so we have made till here and our first part is complete i will be back in our next part um, in part 2 uh, in that i will show you the body part the rest of the body part so so i hope you like my tutorial and also please don't forget to like comment and subscribe and thanks a lot bye